Good morning. Over the next several days, we have quite an incredible event here in New York. Monday, we start out with our foundational excellence program. This is done jointly with Cornell University. This program was specifically designed to fill a gap in the training programs of the produce industry. The foundational excellence program is really valuable to people who are entering the industry who might not necessarily have a background in the industry. So I'm gonna uh, talk about Amazon and the food system and what's the particular role of produce uh, in that system. The foundational excellence program can be useful for just about anyone at any level coming into the produce industry. We have a reasonable follow-up of people at the end of the programs uh, each year. We always encourage people to follow up with us. The, the faculty team at Cornell is very industry oriented. There might be young people right out of college or it could be senior people who are expert in marketing or food safety and now have joined the produce industry. Might be geared towards a younger set, but I still go to it because I learn an awful lot. I mean, I think it's geared for everybody in the industry to attend this. I was privileged to participate in the Foundational Excellence Program. This is uh, one of multiple years that we've put some of our staff members through that program because it really is. I think it's a great foundation for us to train our staff. I found the Foundational Excellence Program wonderful. I thought all the keynote speakers were really insightful. It's a great base for someone to jump into this industry. I just became the Eastern Produce Council president in April. Our leadership class, there are our inaugural class, has now at this show just completed their first year that we've been to port tours, we've been to packing houses, we've been on farms, and then the culmination of all of that was the Foundational Excellence Program on Monday, which they all said they got great benefit from. We're learning about the industry, more than I would in a classroom setting, from real life examples, from people who have been in the industry for many years. I have not come across any other organization that spends so much time thinking about how that young people could get involved in the produce industry. I come here and I'm able to meet people, tell them what I'm working on, and so it sort of ends up being a bit of a cycle where I work on projects, come back to report, get new projects to take home. And of course this helps the old industry to focus on being productive and moving ahead. If you can succeed in the produce business, you can do anything, but once you, once you learn about the produce business and how it goes about it, it sparks something in you and you don't want to do anything else.